ever felt that you were not good enough to do something important because someone told you you were not qualified for it? This did not keep me, Glass Elwood, from becoming a missionary to China, and that led to the adventures of a lifetime. In 1929, in London, at age 27, I got kicked out of Bible college because my grades were not good enough, and I was too old to be a missionary. I quickly got a job after that as a housemaid for a man who used to be an explorer to China. He wrote books about his explorers, and I read them, and I practiced pretty good at soapbox every day I did in the park. I did not care how silly I looked. Well, in 1930, I earned enough money to buy a train ticket to China. When I got there, I helped the missionary Mrs. Lawson open it in because the mule tears would pass by in the town Yang Chang, and they would, and I would have to call them in. I would say, we have no bugs, we have no fleas, good, 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 come, come, come. Muyo Beach, Muyo Gutso, how, 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 lie, lie, lie. Mrs. Lawson would tell them Bible stories because the Chinese love stories. Then the muleteers would go out into the other villages and they would spread the Bible story around. That way other people would know God's word. After Mrs. Lawson died from a sudden accident, I had no money to support me from the Christians. Then, luckily, the Mandarin came to the leader of the region and he asked me if I could be his foot inspector, his official foot inspector. I said yes. A while after that, I had to stop a blood, wait, wait, but, oh, I had to, I, the Mandarin said I had to order woman's feet under 30 unbound. A while after that, I stopped a bloody prison riot. They called me all way day for a church one. 1938, when the Japanese invaded, this this is what I'm most known for. When the Japanese invaded my city, Yang Chang, I had to leave, I had to lead almost a hundred children over Rocky Mountains to safety. It took over 12 days to walk. Everyone survived. These are a few of my adventures. What if God gives you a dream? Step into where that dream is going and see what God will do for you. Hello? Very good, under three minutes.